I know that this is wrong, but I guess they don't understand love like ours. Maybe they never will. Well, isn't our love the same as theirs? It is. God blesses you on this day and forgives those that ask his forgiveness. Sinner! 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 I've been having impure thoughts. I can't make these thoughts go away. I don't know if I want to. We are living in a very rapidly changing time, a time that promotes things like equality. Hey, think fast. I'm Ryan Morris, sports journalism. I'm actually doing a cover story on you for The Observer. Really? A cover story, huh? They teach our innocent children that they can love whomever they want to love, even someone of the opposite sex. Do you think that's right? I don't think so. My dad's begged the coach not to cut me from the team, so she made me the towel boy of the girls' team. You shouldn't be friends with her. It is perfectly okay for boys to be friends with girls. No, it's not. Reverend Rachel says it's a sin. That's not what she meant. I am just rewriting Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet. Why? This is a copy of Romeo and Juliet. You'd make a great Romeo. You think so? Yeah, and maybe if I got Juliet, we could practice our lines together. Ew. Romeo and Juliet? That's so queer. What are you, Emily? Some kind of row? What? No. What's a row? Heterosexual. Well, what's a heterosexual? <sighs> Something you're too young to know about. Row! 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 Did you know that your friend Ryan was kicked out of his fraternity? Oh, that question for that question. They think he's a closet hetero. Isn't that funny? It's really surprising. You know, some years ago, they hid behind closed doors, as they should have, as they should still. But now, they live very openly. They live brazenly. They live without remorse.